Greetings, pallets and passengers. Have you ever experienced seeing the same number everywhere? Maybe you've seen 222. Maybe you've woken up at 333. I've had some experiences where I've woken up and seen... I've had some experiences where I've woken up or had dreams about a number. When you see the same number repeated, numbers in synchronicity, this is numerology. Numerology is a little bit like astrology and it's the study of numbers. The belief is that the universe is a system and that by breaking the universe down, everything is sort of made up of numbers. And by examining these numbers and taking a look at them closely and finding out their meaning, it can help you understand your life, situations you are going through, messages you're receiving from spirit. I think on the basic level, if you see numbers in synchronicity, it's a message that spirit are watching over you, your guides are taking care of you and showing you that they are around you and that you need to start paying a little bit more attention because they've got messages to tell you. A little bit further than that, once you get into numerology, these numbers can have meanings, they can explain situations you're in, they can give you hope and strength and power to know that you are doing all right. In my experience, I often see synchronicity in numbers regularly. I've seen 11, 11, 12, 12, 15, 15. And I always think when you see that, it's just a nice little message from spirit to say, hello, we're watching over you and we love you lots. But I've also had dreams of numbers before and it's always very vivid dreams and I never forget them. One instance was back at university this would be back in February. I had a dream one night. It was a very strange dream that had won the lottery. And the numbers that I had used were 777. Just some of the numbers, but 777 was one of the numbers. And it wasn't just the number 7. Like I said, it was 7 repeated 3 times. And when I had that dream, I knew it was something significant because it was so lucid, it was so vivid and... I couldn't forget it, I remembered every detail. I remember specifically seeing the lottery card as if it was sort of in my hand and I remembered all the little details of it. So when that happens I always know that that's spirit trying to tell me something. The first thing I did was wake up and find out what 777 meant. What is the numerology behind that number? So we're going to take a look at that and go into a little bit of that and then tie it to the situation I was going through. So to understand 777, you kind of got to look at the number 7 itself first. This is the actual website I actually looked at originally. It's quite a good website, it's called The Secret of the Tarot. I recommend you check it out if you see numbers and you want to go a bit further into numerology. 7 is a significant number because it's the sum of 3 and 4 which are both very significant numbers because they emphasise creative expression because three is the number of creative forces at work and four is the completion of creative work and the building of strong, enduring foundation. Seven is supposed to be a really special number because it's the combination of both of these, that it's creativity built on a solid foundation, finding focus, things you want coming into reality, these creative things. Seven also represents internal wisdom and development associated with spirituality, intelligence and contemplation. And you see seven everywhere, so it's a valid point. We've got seven days in a week, seven colours in a rainbow, seven chakras. It's a very grounding number and it occurs in everything. Then we go take a look at 777. Seven is seen as the number of hidden inner wisdom and that there's a force in the universe that is giving your life a particular shape. You could look at this as a creative energy, God, spirit, whatever you believe in. Seven refers to our connection with this hidden essence which is founded on creativity and the ability to attract to ourselves the material circumstances that we want by focusing our attention in the right way. And 777 is the number three times, so it's triple the power, making 777 the number of our inner wisdom becoming focused in creative activity, ultimately finding a foundation in material reality. So when 777 is operative in your experience, you will find your plans finding focus and becoming reality. Especially if you are positively focused and open to the messages the universe is sending you. So you just got to be open and accepting. 
It's also tied to some major spiritual changes taking place, particularly with spiritual growth. Spirit are basically monkeying around it with you and making sure that you are developing yourself spiritually and are well on your way with a spiritual awakening journey. Further down on this page, it talks about how 777 appears during positive feelings and circumstances, that you are on a path to fruition and your desires are built on a firm foundation of wisdom allied to creativity. And it's to do with different subjects and pursuits, particularly artistic projects, music, writing, creative projects and topics and ideas and all that creativity, which is going to manifest in a very positive and strong manner. In the time that I had this dream back in February when I was at uni, Dead Fly didn't even exist yet. Dead Fly was just something that was floating around in, in the air and it was just an idea and it was something that hadn't come to fruition yet because I was still at uni, I was still working, but the idea was still there. The messages we got that we're gonna start this channel were still hanging in the air and I was very excited about starting the channel. To me, looking back, 777 was a positive reminder that what I was going to create, the foundations that I was going to build, were going to come into fruition and they were going to be really positive and really successful and that I was going to enjoy this journey and it was going to be incredibly creative and an outlet for me to create whatever I wanted. And if you notice, in my Twitter handle, 777, same with Instagram, Deadfly was already taken as a handle in the username, so bit harsh, whoever's nicked it. But <laughs> I decided to stick 777 on the end of it because to me that was a very magical number and it was the number that I associate most with Dead Fly because I had that dream and I feel that having those numbers tied to this project give it a little bit extra magic and it's just something that I can look back on. Of course some people associate it with the occult or something ridiculous but it's not to do with that at all. The meaning behind Dead Fly 777 is numerology and a dream I had back at university. A couple of days ago I had another dream where I saw numbers in it and again, I knew it was very significant and I knew it was sent by spirit as a message because I could remember the dream very well. It was very vivid. I remembered all the details. It was my dad in the dream with a spreadsheet and the spreadsheet had the numbers 5, 7 again and the number 444. But there was heavy emphasis on the number 444 and I paid attention to that the most during the dream and outside of the dream too because it stuck in my mind. There was also a storm outside. We'd built a water slide. It was built out of random bits of furniture and there was a storm brewing, a really big storm, lightning, blue lightning, purple lightning too and it was crazy. And we had to rush to bring everything out inside. To me that was sort of saying, there's a storm coming, a really big storm, so you gotta watch out for it. Not necessarily in a bad way, but there's things brewing right now. When I woke up, I looked up what the meaning was of 444 and again, it was very relevant. To me, it was very, it stood out to me and it made sense. This is the actual website I looked at to read about 444. The website is called Sun Signs. It's quite a nice little website which goes into some numerology and it talks about it being an angel number. Now to me, I like to look at these numbers and numerology as messages from spirit, not necessarily messages from angels. I think in some instances they are simply messages from your loved ones and I don't doubt that there are times they do have connections to angels but in my personal belief I associate these messages with just spirit, my loved ones, maybe my uncle Andrew. The numbers 444 bears the meaning of honesty and inner wisdom as a sign that angels or as I would say spirit, are sending you encouragement. Therefore you can continue to work hard and pursue your passions. 444 represents your rigorous goal seeking nature. It also applauds you for your drive to do better in life. Determination, endurance and productivity are all words that describe the sense of seeing the number 444. God, universal energy and your guardian angels are where you've been steadily working towards your goals. It also acknowledges that you've been productive in all that you do. It reminds you to stay on the life path you are on. 
It also stands for guidance to rely on the encouragement of your angels, thereby they tend to lead you towards your promising future. It also represents air, fire, water and earth, all of the elements, and it also represents north, east, south and west too. These energies combined are helping you achieve the goals you're seeking through naturalistic force. There is a power release through the atmosphere just for you. These elements have the design to strengthen your walk down the path of success. So it does talk about the biblical meaning as well, that in the Bible it represents the times and seasons. In the book of Genesis, God created heavenly bodies on the fourth day. That is the sun, moon and the stars. The sun and moon enable us to determine time and seasons. With the position of heavenly bodies, we can discern night from day and the four different seasons experienced in the world. And again, as I've mentioned, it talks about north, east, south and west. Furthermore, 444 signifies a higher purpose. Honesty, health, determination, success, inner wisdom, intuition, confidence. Through this number, spirit are by your side in everything you do. Every decision you make is influenced by divine intervention. You've been working on your spiritual growth, and with the guidance of your guardian angel, everything will go well. Blessings will flow your way because of your faith and acceptance of the grace of God or creative energy, which is sufficient for all human beings. The connection you have with spirit is so strong that they guide your every decision and action. Positive energies roam around you in your daily activities, which is so lovely. For the down this article, it states that spirit will manifest themselves in your life through 444 to reveal to you that it is important to set strong foundations for a better future to come. Your guardian angel will guide you in making the right decisions in life to succeed. Hard work and determination will enable you to achieve everything you have set your mind to. Your guardian angel is pushing you to draw nearer to divinity to get the help necessary. The number four is a divine number. It connects you to the angels, universal energies and God. In the event you feel helpless and in verge of giving up, remember, divine realm is on your side and fighting for you. All hard work that you've been putting previously in different projects will bear fruit when you start seeing 444. Keep going to achieve your goals and objectives. Don't stop working hard the moment you receive that which you have been working for. Continue working even harder to build your empire. To me, this was very relevant and made a lot of sense for the reason why I was seeing 44 after reading that. Because I've been putting a lot of hard work into the channel recently. I've been doing daily videos, been working on the podcast, been keeping busy and trying to stay on top of things. And to me, this was a nice message to say that everything I'm doing will have a positive outcome. The universe has noticed that I'm working hard. I just need to keep going and keep pushing because the universe will always reward hard work and at the end of the day if I keep pushing myself and keep working hard I will get where I want to be. I just need to have more faith and just trust that spirit are watching over me and sending me lots of love along the way and I always know that they are. So seeing that message was really wonderful and seeing it in a dream, I love when I get dreams like that because it reminds me that spirit are listening and spirit wants to talk to me and they can send little messages across through numbers. I think numerology is a very powerful thing and people just need to start paying more attention to it. Once you start paying more attention to potentially getting messages from a spirit, seeing what they have to say, they will send you it and they are going to be sending you messages right now. You just need to open your eyes a little bit and look around you and pay attention because you might see things that you haven't noticed before. Part of that could be numerology, the synchronicity of numbers. Have you seen any numbers repeated recently? Have you seen numbers everywhere you go and you can't stop paying attention to them? Leave me a comment down below because I would really love to hear about your experiences. I'd like to say that if you'd like to support the channel, please subscribe to Dare to Fly Today and get ready to take flight. Turn on notifications so you get notified every time I upload a video. Like and share this video with others. If you'd like to support the channel further, you can make a one-off donation via my coffee page which will go towards helping buy me some rocket fuel for my ship. Or you can also make donations via my PayPal and links to both of those will be down below in the description box. I hope you all have a wonderful blessed day wherever you are in the world. Stay true, stay blessed and stay awake. And as always, fly high, fearless.